Yo, what's going on guys? DJ has here, collectivekicks.com. I wanted to bring you guys a detailed look and review of the Air Force One uh, flying it that you can see right here. And I have to tell you guys that this is one of the pairs of shoes that I ended up getting uh, from a Nike haul that is probably my favorite one of the group almost because this is the, the sleeper one that I actually almost did not uh, buy. And then I, um, I went ahead and bought them and then I tried them on once I got home. Uh, but if I would have tried these on in the store, I would have been sold on them instantly. These ones are super crazy comfortable for some reason. And not only are they really, really comfortable, they're super lightweight. So one of the historical things about the Air Force One that I was never kind of a huge fan about is the weight of the shoe. The Air Force One is super heavy. Uh, but, you know, they did do something like this. And shout out to the real Ray Ray. He actually sent me these ones a while ago in this crazy orange BHM colorway that he ended up finding. Uh, but this one has the Lunar Lawn midsole, which was a step up for sure. Uh, because the Lunar Lawn made this a lot lighter. Plus, you can see the, the upper is, is kind of a, a different material than the leather. That, but the, the midsole was definitely an improvement because it was so heavy on the regular pairs. So fast forward to the modern uh, days and we have this crazy flying it one. And So I'll show you guys the box. This is the Nike Air on the Air Force One on the box, as you can see. And then the Ultra flying it low Air Force One, you can see. And I went true to size with 9.5. 160, a little bit steep on the price point. That's the low. But um, but I have to tell you, dudes, when you try these on, it's just like they're heavenly. They feel amazing. <laughs> um, yeah, so you can see I wore them a little bit dirty already. But uh, but they're just super lightweight. And I don't know what this midsole is made out of. It's just different than uh, than even the Lunar Lawn ones. It's just a different material. But it's it's very, very like light. And it just feels really good on your foot. And then when you step on the inside, the insole, there's a lot of cushioning when you walk. So um, I highly recommend these shoes. If you haven't tried them out yet, you can get them under retail on eBay. I'll put a link in the description. I've also tweeted some links to like sneakers and stuff, had 25% off for retail. And a lot of places um, will do 20% off like on Foot Locker and stuff like that. I'm pretty sure that these are included. Comes with metal lace uh, tips, as you can see uh, right here. And really nice fly knit on the, the upper. And I kind of like how they, they, they kept the, the form of like the Air Force One on the upper and this um, knit material. Have regular laces, but then you have the leather swoosh right here. And then the little back part right here that definitely uh, is kind of the staple on the Air Force One. And then kind of this part right here as well. Um, so that's kind of an overview of the shoe. They're just really crazy comfortable. And uh, I'm, I'm like super blown away by how um, nice these are actually in hand and on feet and it's one of those ones where you wouldn't have guessed it and I would have never thought of actually buying these um, unless I actually got them for the price I did and now that I got them for this price I know I would have paid full retail for them just because uh, they are really really nice and there's a uh, look at the uh, the knit the other thing is is obviously because it is this uh, fly knit material it's extra breathable so it's breathable lightweight and comfortable but you have the classic Air Force One silhouette this is like a grand slam in my opinion and a sleeper uh, out there in the sneaker releases. I'm going to go ahead and put an on feet section right here. So let me know what you guys think about the Air Force One on feet. Uh, this is the Flyknit version and I I'm definitely digging this shoe. It makes me kind of want to keep my eyes peeled and see what other things Nike's doing with the Flyknit Ultra stuff. Uh, they definitely have done some really cool stuff. Still want to try the Prestos. I haven't tried them uh, as the point of this video yet, but hopefully I'll get them soon. But uh, Air Force Ones, these ones are super, super sick. Might actually want to try a pair of the, the high tops or the mid tops as well uh, because all I have is the low tops. But these low tops definitely going to go right into the summer rotation because they're, again, lightweight, uh, comfortable, and breathable and uh, in that classic Air Force One look. So thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, smack the thumbs up. And uh, I appreciate you guys for watching. We'll catch you guys for some more videos soon. Peace, guys.